Daniel, I appreciate you showing up today to help me with these questions. I have 11 questions I want to ask you. Uh, the goal is to determine if a generation or two, uh, was it behind me? Are you behind me or in front of me, dude? Generation I will two. be in front of you. A generation two in front of me. Okay. I want, the, the goal is to find out if a generation or two, you're actually two generations ahead of me, um, know what these things are. So are you ready? Yes. Right, here's question number one. What is a CD? A CD is a circular disc used to output certain things. It kind of depends on the things. Okay. I'll give you that you know. You, do you know there are actually two types of CDs? There's the answer. There's two answers to that question. You gave one answer. Do you know there's another answer? I did not. Here, I'll give you one. Certificate of deposit. It's where you, it's where I put all my money. You know the sixteen million dollars I tell you I have in my mm -hmm, mind. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, here's the next question. What's a Rolodex? What's the what? What is a Rolodex? Rolodex. Um, I do not know. I'm not okay. sure. All right. It's all right. If you don't know what a Rolodex is, it's okay. All right. Here's the next question. What's a Rolex? A Rolex is a watch, a brand of watch. Brand, a brand of good. What is long distance? Long distance is a distance that is above average. <laughs> <laughs> what does it have to do with? What's it pertaining to? Usually online, usually like online, it can be long distance online. Okay. Maybe, maybe a telephone, maybe a telephone that could, that could be a example of a long distance. Okay. What's dial up? Dial up. I know dialogue, dial up. I'm assuming that means kind of like more. What is a collect call? Collect call is when there's more than two people on a call. Who is Bruce Lee? Bruce Lee was a uh, well-known fighter, actor, martial arts um, competitor. Okay. You're doing good with some of them. What's a fax machine? A fax machine, it prints off things with things on paper. Prints off things on paper. Yes. Okay. Yes. What about a mimeograph? Mimeograph. Mimeograph. I am not sure. I do not know that one. No one. What's a Walkman? A Walkman. I don't know that one either. I don't know. I don't know a lot of these words. It's all right. Don't worry. What's a modem? Modem. That one I also do not know. That one, that okay. one's a, that's a hard one. What's a dot matrix printer? Diametric printer. A dot, dot matrix printer. Dot matrix printer. Once again, I do not know. Don't know. You know what, Daniel? Thank you for your help. But just so uh, here, let me give you some answers. Yeah, for the sake of the audience, because there's going to be other people who are two generations ahead of me that may see this video, and I'm going to answer the questions. What's a Rolodex? It's a thing where you put business cards in there, and it ro rotates around, and you can find alphabetically business cards. Rolex watch you got. CD is um, a music. Um, mu a CDs came about primarily with music on CD, but then you could also use CDs to store data. You could actually stick a CD in the side of your computer and take data off it or files off and put data on it. Uh, what's long distance? Long distance telephone calls. Back in the days when your mama was a baby, uh, when you made a long distance phone call out of state, you paid extra money to make that phone call. Uh, what is dial up? Dial up is um, back in the day, you would hook your, mod your modem up to your telephone 
And when you want to get on the internet, the modem would make a phone call and dial up to the internet. Yeah. Um, Bruce Lee, you a oh, collect call. A collect call is it back in the day, dude. When if I want to call you, and this is satire from jail or from somewhere, and I didn't have any money, I could make a collect call and the operator would go. Mr. Alonzo, Mr. Burris wants to make a collect call to you. Will you accept the charges? And, you know, you had to pay. You paid for me to call you. Um, a fax machine. A fax machine is back in the day. Although they still have them. They're, they're a business tool today. They hook up to the telephone line. They have a phone number, just like a telephone. And one fax machine would copy, just like a copier does, copy the uh, date, the, the a picture of the paper, and it would send it through the phone line to the other fax machine. It would print it out. So you were you were close to that. A mimeograph machine is an old way of making copies. You would actually type out what you wanted to type out on mimeograph paper, and then you would stick it on this on this drum. And then you would crank it or it would have electric crank and it would make copies. So sort of like a copier using a drum. A Walkman is before CDs, you'd have music on a, a little, uh, you know what an iPod is? It's sort of like an iPod, except you would stick cassette tapes. Do you know what those are? Yes, I do know. You would stick tapes. cassette tapes in your Walkman and you'd be walking down the street, you know, banging around with your Walkman. A modem, I told you, was a hookup to the phone line to cut, make a dial-up phone call. And a dot matrix printer is back in the day. We didn't have the fancy printers we have now, digital printers. But what they had was a printer that uh, it would go, it sort of like a typewriter. It would go across the paper like this, but it, it would have nine little dots, okay, three by three on a ribbon, and it would hit the ribbon and it would print out the letters in a nine by nine, it, really old school stuff. So that's what that stuff is. Daniel, thank you for letting me share yep. that with two generations ahead of me, buddy. No problem. All right, man. See you another All day, right. buddy. See you. Have a good day.